Louis Lorasso was born in Elizabeth, New Jersey in 1926 and got his start in what would become the DeCavacante family in the early 50s. He was a good money maker, being involved in gambling and loan sharking. At the age of 30, he gets made a capo. Fat Lou, as he was called, was promoted to underboss in the early 60s and served under Sam the Plumber DeCavacante. Within a couple of years, both Sam the Plumber and Fat Lou go to prison for gambling. Interestingly, as underboss, Fat Lou did a favor for Carlo Gambino and took out a Gambino associate named Joseph Viola, who was accused of being an informant. Sam and Fat Lou got out of prison in the 70s and Sam decides to step down, appointing John Riggy as boss. Riggy actually bumps Fat Lou down to soldier. After Riggy goes to prison, John D'Amato is made acting boss and Jake Amari is acting underboss. D'Amato didn't like the old-timer Fat Lou because he felt that he was going to make a move on the family with a capo named Charles Majuri. On November 11, 1991, Fat Lou turns 65 years old and his birthday present from John D'Amato is being rubbed out by a hit team consisting of Anthony Capo, Louis Eggs Consavo, and Gregory Rago.